Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Minecraft. Uh, today I'm actually hiding in a hole. The reason being is I actually have spoilers outside um, and they'll be coming to you in a few episodes. So obviously I want to go and keep them a little bit hidden. Um, if you were a part of the stream weekend that we've just done this weekend, gone over on YouTube, Mixer or Twitch, thank you very much for stopping on by. I appreciate you all. Uh, obviously, as I say, you can see some of the exclusive previews um, on the YouTube channel if you want. Um, but obviously, as I say, there's not really much there. Um, a couple of things to quickly cover as well. We now are on a sort of dedicated server we're using Eternos um, so it means that in theory the frame rate and everything and stability should be a little bit better because my computer's not doing all the work plus I have Optifine so obviously we go and have the uh, frame rate boost from that as well plus we have GT Zoom key now as well so that gets used a lot uh, plus dynamic lighting you will go and find that's going to shoot me in the foot quite a bit. So today we are going to be doing something very interesting. We're going to the end. Before we go to the end, we've got to obviously find the stronghold. Once we find the stronghold and make it to the end, we need to fight the Ender Dragon. But I don't want to just do it the same old way everybody else does. I'm going to fight the Ender Dragon using these. So, for those of you who aren't aware, if you go and place a bed in the nether or in the end, the game goes and makes them explode. Now, as long as you have a block in front of you to go and take the brunt of the damage, in theory, you shouldn't die. In theory. Let's find out. Okay, so I have cheated a little bit. I have used a mist to go and see if I can go and locate the, uh, the stronghold, which I have managed to do. The nearest one to me is at... Whoa, 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 what? Why are they mad? Uh, okay, uh, blocks. Locks, quick. Come on, get through the portal. Get through the portal. Because you will just despawn. Anybody else? Anybody else? Uh, that was really weird. That was super weird. Um, okay. Which one are you? You're my Fortune 3 girl. Why are you in the nether? Okay. I remember that it got out because I had a creeper explosion. I didn't realise he had gone through the portal, though. Okay, so he's now at least safe. Nothing in the nether can go and hurt them. This is also the reason why I carry a flint and steel on me. Ugh. Ow. Oh my gosh, just stay still. Okay, let's just get out of here. Um, and... Proceed. I can't actually remember where the uh, crossover point is. Where is the part where I cross over? Where even am I? 
okay, I'm a little bit flustered here. Um, so yeah, as I was saying, basically the um, stronghold coordinates are at 544 and minus 1280 in the overworld. So I just need to go and find... So i got to go that way and that way. So it's this sort of way. So let's go and get going on this. Uh, and yeah, we're going to go and find out what happens, basically. So I'll bring you guys back when I'm a little bit further along. And... Uh, have a bit more progress for you. Okay, guys, so I've went and come down this tunnel here. We are at the coordinates of what I've got. So the center of the portal, uh, I've done it a three-wide one, hoping that it will actually go and do. Um, so we're on 68 minus 160. So if my maths is correct, we should go through here. And hopefully... Hopefully... Arrive directly in the stronghold. Okay, I got nervous then. <laughs> I was very, very nervous then. Um, unfortunately, my uh, pick actually died. So that's a thing. Um, we may obviously have to go back and get... Another pick, but whilst we're here, let's go and have an explore around. I also did forget torches. Well, that leads nowhere. there. That doesn't lead anywhere. Uh, okay. The only place that leads, and we don't even have a button. Do I have anything that can open the door? Hello, I can see the loot. You know what? We're doing this old-fashioned way. We are going to punch a door down. There we go. Finally. So, um, well, that's useful. That, not so much. Um, the nether adventure was pretty, um, like, there, there was nothing really that happened apart from, obviously, the experience that we had at the beginning um, of where it was we went into the nether and all the pigmen hated us. Which was very, very interesting. I'm still not 100% sure what caused that. Uh, books and paper? Not really of use. Uh, I see you down there. There's the ladder. Alright. Uh, Skilly butt. Hi! Be dead. Uh, right, where now did I see that other chest? There was another chest in here. Uh, another chest. Am I going crazy? Could have sworn I saw another chest. Oh, help if I actually get the ones on the floor as well. Okay, where's the ladder again? Right, let's go and have a look. Up. There it is. Okay, so... Hoping there's something good in this and not just books and paper. No, wasn't that one. There it is. Uh, efficiency 4 book. Yes, please. And you can have some... Rotten flesh. I think that's a fair trade. 
so the main thing that I'm actually now got to be on the lookout for is obviously the portal room. Um, and it's also why it says that the Ender Pearl was useful, but the Iron Armor was not. Um, the reason why it's useful is it's because I don't actually own any Ender Pearls. Oh, here we go again. Um, so if the portal frame is empty, that means that we are going and hunting Enderman. Um, and obviously also we need to go and then go back to the base to go and get some blaze rods to make the eyes of ender to come all the way back to obviously fill the portal frames in so the other reason obviously there is why i've also picked up that efficiency book i could have th well that one spawns with a button i am very confused Okay, so is this the same room that I was just in? No. Uh, I'm breaking through, look at the sea. Have some spider eyes. Running out of things to give them. Uh, nothing useful in that one. Okay. Uh, door technology. Uh, okay, so this is the way that I've just came in. Hi, Exploder. Oh, great. One of you guys again. <sighs> In case you can't tell, um, the reason why I'm actually quiet is because I'm very, very nervous for this dragon fight. Um, I have done this once before. So I know that it does work. The only thing that is making me uh, nervous is I did die quite a few times. Yeah, now see, this had a button there, but it didn't have a button on the other side. Okay, yeah, so this leads nowhere there, and this one doesn't lead anywhere as well. Right? Have I got a Dudge Stronghold? Is that a thing? Uh, let's get the cam account on and let's have a... Wait, what? Really? I never knew that that happened. Hallelujah, we found the portal room. Uh-oh. Oh, those things are so annoying. Uh, right, so the one that I'm going to do is... There it is. No, it was. Let's kill this guy. Because they're just annoying. We are going to block off Barber. Oh no! <sighs> Stupid bugs. And 
Let's see if we can go and break it with our fists. Probably not. I know you should never go and break a spawner, but I'm not going to go and do anything with it. It's just going to be a nuisance, so... He's not happy that I'm breaking his spawner. There we go. Done. All of them keep like spawning and then falling in the lava and this is not a sign that I wanted. Oh no. This is a very bad thing. Um So this portal only has two. Oh, no. That is not good. That is not good at all. Right. Okay, so now we're lit up in here at least. So we need... 10. Eye of Enders. Okay. So I'm hoping if I go and... Build a portal... Uh, hang on, I want to do... Yeah, I'm not going to be able to fit it there. Uh... See if we can go and just find somewhere nearby to possibly fit this portal. Or at least see if we can locate our old one. Ah, there. Okay. So let's get back now. Um, we're going to go and get some Enderman on a night time. Whoa! Uh, yes, yeah, so we're going to go and kill some Enderman on a night time. Go and try and uh, get some ender pearls, make some eye of enders, and then we'll come back. So I'll do that majoritively off camera, um, unless obviously something interesting happens. So I'll bring you guys back in a while. Okay, so I went and did an evening fighting mobs, or at least a few of them. Uh, it then became very late at night, so I went to bed. And this is the following evening. Okay, so we have made it back. Um, the only one concern I am worrying about is it's the baked potatoes over the steak. Uh, that could be interesting to go and find out how well we do there. We are going to now put all of this stuff into there and get ourselves organized now. Uh, I actually just realized I put all my cobble back in and I need that stuff. Uh, okay, so the plan is we will set our respawn point here. So meaning we can go and just cheese it back in if we uh, need to. Try and gather our stuff back up. Um, and as I say, the main one that we are going to do is, is we're going to go and get all the towers down first. Trying to obviously avoid the dragon. Uh, try not to be killed by Enderman. And uh, I want to try and deal as much damage as I can with beds. Okay. So we're going to take our last steak. That gets our saturation to full. We get our potatoes in hand. Let's get at it. Okay. Not the greatest. Uh... Okay, get over, and now we're going to 
just gently slope it up. Okay. Um, but as I was uh, mentioning earlier, I have sort of... Uh, I'm not going to say cheated, because obviously a mist is a very useful tool that everyone does have access to. But if you guys fancy me going and actually doing a... Uh, okay, she's there. Um, a one of it's where I actually have to go and find the... Um, Stronghold by actual means then please do go and let me know in the comments section and uh, Oh Jeez, she's very scary Ow hurty magic ow hurty magic ah not good Okay uh, Where's my water bucket as well? I haven't got that on the bar. That would be an idea. Ah no! Oh no! No 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 no! No, not good! Not good! Not good! Not good! Water bucket! Water bucket! Where's my water bucket? Where are you? Ah! Okay. Not off to the greatest of starts. This is also the reason why we go and do staircase. Uh, right, okay, so now I just gotta go and get all my stuff. And uh, I may actually go and time lapse this because this may take some time. There we go. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, we have finally done it. Oh. And there it is, the beautiful dragon egg that I'm actually going to have to come back for because I don't have a piston or anything on me. 
all the XP. Sort of made all the death worth it. 64 levels. We have done it. As you went and saw by most of that. Oh gosh, that's angry. Oh! Back to the gate. Move! Oh, jeez. Well, that was going to be classed as a derp. So we're up to number five. Um, but yeah, so basically that, using the beds, it works. And it doesn't. Okay, so we're going once more into the end. I got a couple of things with me just so we can try and get this dragon egg. So, first thing we are going to go and do is try not to jump in the portal. And we are going to just space over the portal these uh, blocks. So, when we go and piston push this guy, he's not going to go anywhere other than where we want him to go. So, piston, redstone block, there we go, reach the next generation, I get my redstone back, get my piston back, the cobble can fall in there if it so desires. And then let's just go and clean up the portal so I have it ready for the next time we do a dragon fight. So now let's go through. Should go and bring me to spawn. Oh, and it's night time. Oh dear. Uh, oh, spoilers. Looking at the floor. This is awkward. Uh, don't look... Everybody close your eyes. <laughs> okay, it's have to look. Uh, right, let's get slept. And there we go. So we're going to go and display this in my bedroom. We went and did it. We finally got the dragon egg, which was the whole basis of this episode, was to free the end so and get that achievement and get the dragon egg. Uh, I actually did forget that you got an achievement with the Dragon Egg. Um, but yeah, we had multiple deaths. And also you can see by my XP, um, it's now down to 27. I went and did a little bit of enchanting and uh, basically got re-geared up. So my diamonds have depreciated a little bit. But we now have a Protection 3, Unbreaking 3, Respiration 3 Helmet. Uh, just Protection 4 Chest. Projectile Protection 2, Unbreaking 3, Legs. Blast Protection 4, Unbreaking 3, and Depth Strider 3, which is going to be very, very useful for the project I've got coming up soon. Um, and then we've got uh, an Efficiency 5, Unbreaking 3 pick as well. Um, so yeah, we've went and done really, really well today, guys. I'm really happy with the progress which is happening. Um... A lot of people have been commenting and everything on the videos, which I'd really do appreciate. If you are still here at the end of the video, then hit the like button. Let me know you made it to the end of the video. Hit the subscribe button if you enjoy and would like to go and see more of these. Um, I will also probably be streaming on YouTube now. I know that all three of them work, so you can either find me on mixer.com forward slash ds9fireblade, twitch.tv forward slash ds9 fireblade or on this youtube channel here obviously the links to the others will be in the description below um yeah guys so i hope you enjoyed and i will see you all in the next episode bye for now